Hello guys, this is Amos Doll Music and in today's lesson I'm going to teach you how to play Krabby Step from the Spongebob movie. Okay, I'll be teaching you how to play the instrumental that plays throughout the song with a very iconic theme. Give you a preview. So once you learn this like instrumental, you can pretty much play and sing and rap this song. Okay, so check it out. Give you a preview. Okay, but you can also add like improvisations afterwards to make it like the original like uh, in this song It's kind of like a lot of beats so you can just play around a little bit like That kind of thing, but anyway, so let's get right into the melody and block chords first because that's the foundation of a song Afterwards you can choose to just keep it like that to play and sing with it or you can just add improvisations to Make it more awesome. Okay, but anyways, here we go. We're breaking the lesson up to two parts. It's easier to learn. So the first part, right hand starts on the B up here. Middle C, go up an octave C, up to the B here is where we start. So B, down to G, down to D, back up to G, up to B, G, up to D, B, up to G, F sharp, G, A, G, F sharp, G, down to D, B, G. All right? That's it for the first part. One more time, it goes B, G, D, G, B, G, D, B, up to G, F sharp, G, A, G, F sharp, G, down to D, B. That's it for the right hand. Left hand, we have a chord G major, which is G, B, D. Alright, so with the G major in mind, the two hands together, it goes like this. So, B and G major together. Yeah, really simple, just the first note on the right hand is with the play with the first chord and you hold it. Like that. Alright, and that's it for the right hand and the left hand together. So the main thing is getting the right hand up to speed. Uh, so play slowly first, if you can't get it up to speed, and practice positionings. And start building up the speed. Alright, but anyway, let's move on to the second part. Ryan continues. F sharp, E, F sharp, G, A, B, C, B, A, D, C sharp, D, E, F sharp, D, C, A. Like that. One more time for the right hands. It goes F sharp, E, F sharp, G, A, B, C, B, A, D, C sharp, D, E, F sharp, D, C, A. Like that. Alright? Once again, practice slow it. First, and build up. So, okay, so yeah. lower down, then build up to a quicker speed. Left hand is D major, one chord, just D F sharp A. So with that D major in mind, the two hands together goes like this. So it goes F sharp and D major together. So just the first note again with the chord. So cool. Main thing that's difficult in this song is just the right hand it's like getting it up to speed and the agility of it yeah and that's it so back to back the two parts of learning this lesson will be played like this B. So once you get the melody and chords all good, you can keep it like this and sing over it because as simple as it is, uh, you can easily sing and rap the song easier. But if you want to add improvisations to it, it's riskier, uh, but, but you can. So left hand you can do like octave, arpeggio, patterns. You can do rhythm patterns. That kind of thing, okay? You can yeah, combine it like this. Play around with it. Alright? Yeah, hope you enjoyed this lesson. By the way, if you want to learn other SpongeBob songs, I've done a lot of them on my channel. Just search up SpongeBob Amos Doll in the YouTube search and find all those other lessons for yourself to learn. But as for now, that's pretty much it for today's lesson. 
If you enjoyed this lesson, make sure to check out the rest of my channel because literally there are multiple thousands and thousands of these videos ranging from pop songs of all languages, meme songs, video game music, movie, anime and cartoon theme songs and many more songs of all sorts that I teach. So most likely you can find your favorite song to learn on my channel. Also check out my website, bestpianomethod.com, linked in the description below if you want to learn more piano from me. Learn from my piano courses on how to play by ER, improvise, read sheet music, how to play and sing, and many more courses at all types of levels, even for those who have never touched a piano before. As for now, enjoy your time around my channel and see you next time.